previously on Bad Manor. If we want to stay the best bed and breakfast in Georgia, we need to keep our presence out there. I'm Maxine, Rebecca's sister. You left when you were 18. Never called, never wrote. You know, I could stick around for a while and help out. Hey, where do you want this camel? Maxine, long time no see. Lila's forever, right? You're screwing my dad? How could you? Yes, you like? Oh, I love it. Ikea, have I never told you I spent time in Sweden growing up? Yeah? Are you almost ready? I don't know how much longer I can keep this up. It's just not the same without her here. How did you find me? Your baby told me. Somebody in this house is trying to drive you crazy. Yeah, I'm talking to you, bitch. What? Screwing around on you. It's been lies this whole time. This whole marriage, everything. You've been screwing around on me. Why? How could you? That's it, girl. Tell him. He knows what he did. Can't you hear that? Oh, TJ, oh God, can't you hear that voice? What voice? What is the matter with you, Rebecca? Wow. You've completely lost it. You're a total nut job. How can you say that? You're my husband. You love me. No, I don't. Uh, I despise you. I want a divorce. Uh, Owen, your sister is uh, much better than that. Hey, TJ. <laughs> You've been a bad, bad boy, and you need to be punished. Time out. me avenge and as you can see I'm very much alive how I'll get to that but right now we need to discuss my daughters what do you mean I know what a crap job my daughters have done with this place I'm so sorry for all the grief they've caused you and your mother being their housekeepers but I'm here to make it up to you Lupe or should I say sister how do you know that we're half sisters I've known for some time now. In fact, I planted the evidence in the closet for you to find. Well, actually, it was my assistant, Ashley Haverty. Ikea? Well, that takes care of that. Looks like we 
we won't be in Southern living like we wanted to, but, well, you can't win them all, right? past midnight, Ugh. and our receptionist has gone missing. That's so serious. What are you doing here? Oh, I just couldn't be alone. I mean, not after Charleston shooting. It happened in my house. I can't feel safe there. I needed to be among the safety and comfort of my family. So you think the mob might still be after you and you need a place to lay low for a while? Uh. Okay, I don't mind. Go pick out a room. I would steer clear of Maxine, though, if I were you. And Rebecca? Actually, she's been hallucinating a lot lately. So if things get tense, just tell her she's imagining you. Hmm. Uh, how's Charleston, by the way? Well, since you asked, there's a 98% chance that he won't recover. It's been terrible. He's still in that coma. That damn coma! It's taken our livelihood. There's twice as much work at the shop. Although I must say, my painted pussy prices performs perfectly. Why, I've been painting so many pussies, I've no more pussies to paint. And with that extra revenue, we did have to get two guards for Charleston's hospital room. Security reasons, you understand. I'm sleepy, darling. Could you please point me to the nicest room? Yeah, the candy spelling suite. Oh. It's down that way. You'll love it. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> right. I Ikea? That's Ashley Haverty. Learn it, love it. You're not Swedish? Do I sound like I'm Swedish? Ooh, I hated being Swedish. I had you be Swedish so you wouldn't say much or get in the way of things. It didn't stop you from stealing my boyfriend. Ryland? Please. I never really liked him. It was all just part of the act. Ashley here has been my eyes and ears inside this place for months. Thanks to her, I know everything that's transpired within its walls. And that's why I think it's time for you to know my plan. Plan? Yes. I came back to Smoke Rice Manor to run this with my daughters, but they're both terrible bitches. Rebecca's power hungry and cruel to her staff. So I sent that telegram to France, to Maxine, so she would come home. I had such high hopes for her potential as the new leader of Smoke Rice Manor. But as it turns out, she's a psycho and slowly poisoning her sister to death. And sleeping with her husband. And the way they treated you, poor Lupe. So she had me hide grandfather's box so that you would discover it. And then you would know the truth. Why did you want me to know the truth? Because it's important for you to know we're sisters, Lupe. So that we can run this place the way it should have been run. The way our parents would have wanted it. <laughs> So what now? Well, I'm going to stay here and see how this develops. And as for you two... Can I 
see my baby now? No! Baby will not see you now! You've been a mad, mad good kid. Why did you leave the Unified Mind Control Front? You are one of us! We loved you! I was tired of miming. I wanted to have a voice! But you rocked the moon better than anyone. It was time to move on. Besides, I had just gotten this telegram that my grandmother had died and I might have all this money and... Anyway, just let me see my baby! No! You cannot! What do I have to do to see my baby? I'll do anything. Just let me hold her. Anything? Decor. You will now be a prostitute. Grab your goddess and a clawing perfume and get out on the corner of Mountain Industrial Boulevard, right near the Wendy's. The goat needs money and you are going to provide it. Oh, by your self. What? No way! Just give me my baby! Give it! There ain't no baby in there. But I remember. I remember being pregnant. I remember going into labor. We mime the whole thing. You were so deeply brainwashed that you had a phantom baby. <laughs> Don't you ever hit a woman! I won't allow it! Starla, I've got this. Dead mime. Oh, God. Uh, uh, oh my God. We can stash him in the basement. No one ever goes down there. Of course. Let's do it. Okay, okay. I'll get this one. Okay. okay. All right. Uh, so, I kind of thought when you were saying mind control that you were saying mind uh, yeah. control. So that's, that's what, what I, I thought. Like that was, you made that? Oh, yeah. You think I would have done oh. a mind control for Oh, oh gosh. God. No. My plan worked perfectly. 
crazy Rebecca May goes in <laughs> and tries to kill her entire staff. Oh, fortunately, I was there to save the day. Oh. <laughs> now, now, girls. Is that how Mama taught you to behave? <laughs> <laughs>